Varsity Science Olympiad team. And this is my 2015 Rube Goldberg machine. To start the machine, I have to drop a golf ball into the machine and somehow turn on a buzzer. And so what I do to start it is I drop this golf ball down this tube, which hits a lever here. And this lever will pull a magnet off, letting a float rise up with a golf ball. And as the golf ball is falling into the scoring jug, it will trigger a magnetic switch, which will make the steel wool fuse melt this fishing line, which will then release this tensioned rubber band pulley, which will yank off another magnet here, letting this other float rise up with the second golf ball, triggering another magnetic switch as it falls into the scoring jug, which will set off another um, steel wool fuse, burning through a string, dropping the copper electrode into a chemical battery, which the zinc electrode will already be in, turning on this motor, which will pull off this magnet, letting the float rise with the golf ball, triggering another magnetic switch as it falls down into the scoring jug, which will turn on this motor, pulling this magnet away from this float, letting the float rise up, and the golf ball will trigger another magnetic switch as it falls down into the scoring jug. This magnetic switch will trigger another steel wool fuse, which will burn through this string, releasing this tensioned spring, which will compress, pulling this magnet away, letting this float and golf ball rise up, and as the golf ball goes down into the scoring jug, it will trigger another magnetic switch, which will turn on this motor, yanking this tape away from this sand, the sand will fall through, and as enough sand gets in, it will flip this switch, turning on this motor, which will yank away that magnet, letting the float rise up with the golf ball, triggering another magnetic switch, turning on the buzzer.